Well, many people will recall images of the 1963 grand final and the terrible conditions that led to that famous image of Proven and Summons embracing at the end of the match. Much less is known about the 1953rd test between Australia and Great Britain, played in the most terrible conditions in the SCG. Here's how the match unfolded. So bad was the pitch that it required the spreading of 40 tonnes of sand. The crowd of 45,000 was to witness a contest as sturdy and as close as any in football history. Not surprisingly, in the quagmire conditions, the first half was trialless. Goals to Churchill and Ward saw the scores locked at two all. The struggle was grim and unrelenting. The water bucket, in increasing use, 15 minutes from the end came the decisive blow as the ball sweeps out to winger Ron Roberts. The Aussies hold on to win 5-2 and with it the Ashes for the first time in 30 years. The crowd goes wild. Players, fans and officials dance in the mud and Captain Churchill is chaired from the field. Australia's halfback, Paul Holman, recalls the emotions that overflowed.